Great. So thank you very much for, for that uh, reflection and also for that re-understanding of what we're actually doing. Yeah? So I think that's actually great that we um, learn from this also in the way of, uh, of learning. I'm always in, uh, um, intrigued, Valeria. Would it be possible also to do some sort of mirror kind of situation in, uh, in for instance, the Po Delta region? Would you think that would be possible in a similar fashion that we include uh, cities in uh, along the, the Po River and the whole Delta, uh, which is of course also very much a concentration of urbanization and uh, and economy uh, in in Italy, and 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 in that fashion also make some sort of uh, European kind of agenda out of this. Would you think that would be uh, an idea? Yes, indeed. Uh, we have been working uh, um, with metrics as well in, in, in that area, uh, along the high-speed corridor, uh, trying to understand how that high-speed corridor is generating um, a new urban pattern, but at the same time, new uh, demand of urban quality, urban life, challenging of course because it's uh, it has a profile of uh, more or less sustainability and more or less cohesion let's say so i think we have in common many many challenges and this is also the logic uh, under which i think the delta metropole works very well uh, in order to raise this issue of uh, looking behind boundaries and adopting this uh, this vision so definitely 